Kate Middleton and Prince William faced a crisis in 2007, when the rod had set into their relationship and they weren't spending any time together, according to claims made by a royal biographer. Kate Middleton and Prince William are now happily married and the proud parents of Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. However, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge have faced some bumps along the way on their path to happy family life. Royal author Marcia Moody, in her 2013 book Kate, a biography, describes how the rod had set in when their relationship reached a crisis point in 2007. It came only a month after Kate's 25th birthday on January 9, when an angry Prince William had stepped in to defend his then-girlfriend from paparazzi harassment. Ms. Mooney writes, the following month, William gave Kate a pre-Valentine's present of a green enamel Van Cleef and Arpels diamond-framed makeup compact, featuring a polo player about to hit a pearl. Gestures were one thing but the couple weren't spending any time together and cracks were beginning to show and then to deepen. She explains how, the day before Kate's birthday, William had left to begin training at Bovington Barracks in Dorset, which meant the pair could not spend a great deal of time together. She continues, they attended the Cheltenham Festival together but, whereas the previous year it seemed Kate could do no wrong as she hung out with Charles and Camilla, this year she and William looked unhappy and out of sorts. Their matching decades-older tweed outfits were indicative of the rot that had set into their relationship. Ms. Moody explains, William, started spending a lot of time with the rest of his barracks, going out drinking and dancing. Kate grew increasingly fed up and felt his behavior was disrespectful. Ms. Moody was royal correspondent at OK! Magazine and has been writing about the royal family for several years with one high-selling biography about Kate and another about Prince Harry to her name. She describes how, a few days after the Cheltenham Festival in 2007, William was back at his barracks and went partying in nearby Bournemouth. Ms. Moody adds, there was no disguising the fact that William was unsure of their future together. The royal biographer also describes how Prince Philip had advised William's father to make a decision one way or another when he was unsure about Princess Diana, and Prince Charles proposed. However, faced with a similar dilemma, William went the other way. By April that year, Ms. Mooney writes, the relationship of four years was over. However, the couple had weathered a trial separation in their final year of university and they also managed to stick together this time. Ms. Moody writes how they secretly got back together on June 9 when, Kate, attended a party at his barracks to celebrate the end of training. Then, one month later, Kate was in attendance for the memorial concert for the 10-year anniversary of Princess Diana's death which William and Prince Harry organized. As they danced and whispered in each other's ears at the after-party, Ms. Moody writes, the pair realized that this time they wanted to be together forever. The Duke and Duchess went on to marry in their spectacular 2011 royal wedding, after first meeting at university in 2001. Not long after, in 2012, Prince William was furious and disgusted when long lens pictures of the Duchess of Cambridge were published in a French magazine. Royal aides released an official statement, which said, their royal highnesses have been hugely saddened to learn that a French publication and a photographer have invaded their privacy in such a grotesque and totally unjustifiable manner.